All right, guys, it's super important to warm up dynamically before your workout. So what does that mean? It means you're getting your muscles warm and more elastic. So you're moving while you're stretching. So today we're gonna to do a full body, head to toe dynamic warm up. You're just gonna follow along with me. No time, no real reps. We're just gonna to listen to our bodies and we're gonna go with it. All right, so first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna do five hamstring kicks on your right leg. So you're gonna kick to the opposite hands and just kick it up, foot is flexed. So you get a nice stretch in that hamstring, the back of that leg. Let's do two more, and then we're gonna switch sides. Kick it. All right, so now switch sides. Left foot up to that right hand. Kick it. Feel a good stretch in the back of that leg. Only kick as high as you can. All right, now we're gonna do a quad stretch. So you're gonna step, and you're gonna pull the foot to your tushy, and alternate side to side. Grab and pull. Grab and pull. If you can't grab your foot, you can grab wherever you can reach and pull, or you can just stand and kick. Squeeze your hamstring and pull it to your butt. All right, let's do one more on each side. Okay, now we're gonna do a glute stretch. You're gonna grab your shin, pull it up. Okay, step, alternating. Grab like you're trying to get your nose to touch your knee. Pull. Feel a good stretch in that hip, that glute, and get up. Let's do two more on each side. All right, now we're gonna split those feet super, super wide. Okay, toes slightly turned out to the side, and we're gonna push into one leg. Stretch out that inner thigh. Just feel a good stretch here. And push the other side. You might get a little hip crack just like I just did. It'll probably feel good. Shimmy your weight. If it feels nice, you can also go down low and open up that leg. Keep the hands on the ground. Push it side to side. Okay, but if that doesn't feel good or you don't have that today, just push in here, side to side. Let's do one more on each leg. All right, now keeping those legs nice and straight, hands out to the side, you're gonna hinge at your hips, keep your chest down, and you're gonna reach toe to toe. Looking up to the sky, if you can actually grab your toe and pull and look, that'd be great. But only go as far as you can. Pull and twist, chest stays down, legs are straight. Go side to side two more times. All right, standing on up. Let's bring those feet closer together, about hips width apart, and we're gonna do 10 bodyweight squats or air squats. And sit back on your heels and stand. Pushing back on the heels like you're sitting back in a chair. You wanna tap the chair and stand. Get a little burn on the tops of those thighs. Warming up those hips. Let's do three more. All right, now keep those legs where they are. Slight bend in the knees. Body weight, good morning. Hands behind your head. Shoulders back. You're gonna hinge at your hips. Push your booty back to stretch those hamstrings. And stand up. Make sure you push back into those heels like you're trying to get your butt to touch the wall behind you. Toes can actually come up off the ground a little bit. Great posterior stretch, posterior warm up here. Let's do three more. Perfect, all right, come on up. We're gonna do some lunges with a little hip stretch. So we're gonna take a step on the right. I want you to drop down, reach up to the sky, and stand on up and push back together. If you can't get all the way down comfortably, you can stop wherever you need to stop. Reach up to the sky, stretch that hip, and push back. You should feel a good stretch in that hip on the back leg as you lean back. And push, make sure you alternate those feet. Bring it back. Opposite hand goes up to the sky. As the 
that's good, that's it for it. Look up. Good. Let's do two more. Reach. Open up that hip. Go all the way down if you can. All right. Now we're going to lunge and twist. If your right leg's in front, twist to the right. If your left leg's in front, twist to the left. A little strong twist. Warm up that spine along with those hips and thighs. Three more. I don't know about you, but my lower body is definitely feeling warm. All right, so let's hit that upper body now. Take your arms, 90 degree angle here. You're gonna rotate down and up, shoulder openers. Okay, rotate like this, and then pull them back like you're trying to touch the back wall with your fingertips. You should feel a little burning in the back of your shoulders. Down and squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Okay, right about now is when that burning starts kicking in the back of those shoulders. Awesome. Two more, one and two. Keep it right here. Now squeeze in and out. Squeeze your hands together and pull back out. Okay, again, like you're squeezing behind you. In, out, in, out. Ooh, arms are back and we didn't even start yet. Give me five more. Four, three, two, and one. Keep them together here and push. Squeeze them together. Push, push, push. Okay, those elbows are touching. You're squeezing your hands together. Ten more. Shoulders are burning, maybe burning. Five, three, two, and one, good, drop them down. Let's swing those arms up and down. Get a little arch in your spine. Reach up to the sky. Stretch it there. Good. And last one, let's put our hands out here out to the side. Give me another trunk twist. Okay, try to turn behind you. Twist it up. Two more. Awesome. You guys are ready for whatever I've got for you today. 